This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long, and now for the action. Hello, everyone, and a warm welcome. We're at the King Power Stadium in the East Midlands for this one. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Leicester City taking on Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Mason Mount starts alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. Will he play it in? Cuts it back. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Well, what a chance to take the lead, and doesn't he know it? But will they get a better one than that? Well, for the visitors, Stuart, we're talking about the worst defence in the league. Room for improvement, certainly. Well, I have to say, their defending has been really poor this season. No structure, a lack of leadership, and dare I say, a lack of understanding. Unless that improves today, they won't get anything from this game. Given away by Manchester United. Rashford. And the ball with Alfonso Davies. Lisandro Martinez. Diogo Dallo. Encouraging stuff from United. Bruno Fernandes. Vital intervention. Chances on. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Alfonso Davies. And Rashford. Jacob Ramsey. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Lindelof. Alfonso Davies. Anthony Martial. Bruno Fernandes. And now Rashford. And will it be the leveller? And a goal here. Just what Manchester United required. They are level. Well, just admire the pass here. Rashford makes exactly the right decision with his final ball, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. So back underway following the equaliser. Delivered into the area here. No way through. 
Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. Now, how about the short corner? Rashford. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Rashford. And then it's a top-class strike from Fernandez. His technique is absolutely spot on. Just look at the power he generates here. So the action underway again, and certainly the onus is on Leicester to come up with a reply here. Lisandro Martinez. Alfonso Davies. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. It's a fine United move in the making. Martial. Martial. And the keeper there to deal with it. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, time just challenged magnificently. Mount. Amiri. Well, they might be able to launch a counter attack. The cross is on. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Getting close to the half time interval. United with the lead. Stuart, what strikes you about what they put into the game? Well, it's been a good first half so far, and they've been. It's still alive! And the keeper had to concentrate to the ball under duress. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Lisandro Martinez. Mount. The referee's whistle. The first half story has been written. It's half time here at the King Power Stadium. So the second half underway with Leicester behind. Can they turn this game around? Determined defending. Bruno Fernandes has it. Can he find the right pass? And cleared away. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Leicester City facing West Ham United. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams. Oh, it's off the woodwork. Well, what a good effort that was. He didn't have much to aim for, did he? So unlucky, really. So a personnel change then. And a throw in here for United. Dallo. On to Bruno Fernandes. Well, there's defensive solidity for you.
Rashford. And danger averted. Well read. Trying to open up the defence. And holding off his opponent. Ball is loose. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. Well, I have to say, you can understand his frustration. This is going to be an edgy game now. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And into the last 30 minutes now. Lisandro Martinez. Bruno Fernandes has it. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Manchester United facing Everton. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. More than decent this from United. Well read to put an end to that attack. Trying to really get at the opposition here. That's a good-looking ball. And it's in! The back in front! Stunning scenes here! Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. Lindelof. Anthony. Well, they keep passing away. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Into the final 20 minutes. Mabedidi. That's a good pass. Can they keep it out? And a time for cool heads. Anthony. Dallo. Now with Martial. Martial! The save was a good one. And time for the change now. And over comes the corner. Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Ludovic Blas. Well, he's certainly not alone. Pulls it back. Vigorous defending. He had to score, and he does. Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So the current scoreline, 4-2. Alfonso Davies. It's with Martinez. Well, not far away from full time, and a disappointing Manchester United outing this. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Greenwood. 
Fernandes. Big chance. Oh, there it is. A lifeline in this game. And what a finale we could be in for here. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? The clock is against Manchester United here, but their dreams remain alive. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Has a go! He's blocked it! Well, it clearly was deflected, so it will be their throw-in. Get again there to take it away. And he has options available, but they took care of the situation defensively. And so there it is, the final whistle, and Manchester United have lost this game, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, that wasn't a surprise, was it? That's why they have the worst defensive record in the league. It doesn't matter how well they played going forward, if they defend like that, they'll struggle to win games.